on the line, really. Like, there's no pressure. They're just like, free money? Yeah. <laughs> Take that? Yeah, 40 bucks. That's easy. So, a $165 team. Dynamo and Charlie the King going Sheik and Fox versus uh, Afro and Retro Trainer. I actually haven't seen Afro go hard through teams with uh, Retro Trainers. Well, this is something I'm sure they've been working on. But yeah, I wouldn't be surprised. Honestly, this is how the team, how the team goes. Oh, 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 yeah, he's like, oh. Right. So Charlie the King saying, yo, you get, you put $165 on me, I'm going to make your money's worth. He just deleted Retro Trainer off the stage just like that. And uh, that's not something a lot of people can say. Like, once Retro Trainer is off stage, very few people can mess with the necessarily contest it. But uh, yeah, Charlie is immediately eliminating that stuff for their political abuse. And right now, Afro actually looking like a forty dollar investment. I don't know, no, uh, Afro not really contributing too much. Yeah. Um, team one hundred sixty five dollars actually looking really strong right now. Already got the first two stocks. That paid a win. Uh, yeah, I actually think this <laughs> literally paid a win. And like I said, it is two out of three, so every match counts. Yeah. And uh, green team will have some time to adjust. I mean, they're only down one stock each. Not too great of a lead yet. Yeah, normally how their team composition goes, uh, Afro, despite both of them, and then Retro Challenge is constantly disrupting with the bombs up the left or he's projectiles up the right. They it very hard to actually do that many 2v1s on Afro. But right now, I just don't think Mark is a great 2v1 character. What did, what kind of do they have? Uh, normally, I've seen Bayonetta weak weaker trainer or Rosalina weaker trainer. So. Okay, Rosalina weaker trainer. I think from uh, what I'm used to seeing from Afro. Afro weaker. All right, jump behind still. Dymo already jumps first off, but still tries the team. Oh, racking up all the damage and living to really long for seeing this here. Dice yeah. makes up all the legs, go past the legs with Firefox. I think you're really rough turn to get edge guarded, which is actually pretty surprising to say for Fox. And we're coming to Weed Twerk's rescue. Weed Twerk is going to get edge guarded by Charlie King, so we, uh, Afro actually came in and he's up with that. Oh, uh, Charlie goes for another player. He's off stage. He actually is really pressing Weed Twerk trying to off the stage. Oh, no. Wow, double shield. No, yeah, no uh, stage fight for you, man. Charlie is very consistent with the stage. Type okay, up throw finally going to kill the top. Still, first stock. That's it. First stock already did like so much damage, got so many kills already from Charlie. He's doing way too much work right now. Looking like, yeah, the best team money already, you can buy. already oh. in the red. Wow. Run up and up smash. Do it right in his face. I mean, you know, Afro and uh, Retro are a team all the time, but they're looking like they don't know how to handle team day one right now. Dynamo taking Retro Channel off the top. Charlie going to do crazy adjustment swing on Afro, pressing every button he wants right now. This is looking like, yeah, pay to win in the building. Like you said earlier, Charlie recognized if you paid $165, I'm going to make you earn. I'm going to make sure I earn you that investment. Definitely. Are you looking like team synergies, you know, consistent partners, stack partners, none of that matters. All money. You have cold, hard cash. That is what wins this game. In auction doubles. Oh, yeah. <laughs> All right. Let's see if we can actually have a comeback here. I mean, Dynamo's on his last stock. But uh, the Afro really close to dying. And, you know, Weezer Channel is doing what he normally does, hold the stocks, stay at relatively healthy percent, stay on this leg, but not doing a good job of helping Afro right now. Really close to dying. I know Rage Mark is definitely scary, but really showing the 2v1. And as soon as Afro gets out of there, they don't have any shots to, stare, uh, to share. I really think the 2v1 on B is not going to be easy. Weezer Channel is not going to be a really good but if Green Team can take, you know, get that Oh, well. Tipper F Smash. Dynamo, is he going to take the stock from Charlie? You gonna usually, let do the usually you want to take the, the stock, just do that 2v2. But with Charlie, you know, doing such, such a good job of the entire set. Oh. Okay, they're both it. at kill percent, but still, fighting two people at once, not the easiest thing. Fox being a fastball, he's going to be stuck with a whole bunch of combos. And not taking that stock might have been the worst thing that they've done. Look at that Nair. Oh, oh wow. Yeah. See, their 2v1 streak is actually ridiculous, but there's a stock. And we have an even game. Oh, drop the punish. Choke from Charlie the King there. Now we got weak the trainer versus Fox in the 1v1. Going back and forth. But he's oh, going to catch the dash attack up there. Dash attack up there. Going to take the stock. Charlie making sure Dynamo loves his investment. Bro, I'm, I'm surprised that uh, Dynamo didn't take the stock there. That's what I call it. It worked out. 
It's like, oh, I mean, this is what I paid for you, man. Make my money. <laughs> Better carry me. <laughs> <laughs> I Yo, paid for you. Shout to out to the uh, Etika raid right now. Oh, yeah? Oh, Etika raid Etika? in the stream? Yo, shout out to Etika. I didn't even know you were streaming right now, but yo, we appreciate you, man. When are you going to come out to SoCal for 2GG? We'll have you out here. Etika Saga? Oh, yo. I mean, I mean don't we haven't exactly announced the next one yet, so uh, yeah, don't quote me on that. <laughs> no spoilers. <laughs> All right. Oh, speaking of speaking of the, should we tell them to tune in to Shine tomorrow for top eight? Oh right, right, yeah, definitely tune in to Shine top eight, where the next saga trailer is going to be revealed. Um, Nobody yeah. knows. Well, we know. Well, yeah, we showed it here. Everybody who was at here at this tournament, but no one else. Nobody else knows, would know unless someone just went on the internet and just spilled the beans. Like, I hate those people. Anyway. Going back to our set, we're going to go game two over on Final Destination. Is it going to be Final Destination? Yeah, they're hovering over it. And Wouldn't be a bad pick just because of the nature of the, the play styles we have here. Really big stage, going to allow Weech Return to run away to a heart tent. Oh, and Bayonetta is on the screen as well. I wonder why he's switching to Bayonetta and not going to Bayonetta from the start, but needless to say, this is a big dance with time combos. You know, something about Bayonetta and teams is kind of rough because when she does get her combo started, like the ladder combos, it's actually pretty easy for the partner to get up to and kind of cut those combos short. So I'm really curious to see what he's going to do with this Bayonetta. Charlie is playing a character that's ridiculous with that. Really uh, able to cover Dynamo if Dynamo gets caught up in the Bayonetta. Uh, really good team screen there from the blue team. Sheik back there into the Fox in there. Sheik actually has really good throws and uh, really good arrows just for doing two and two one combo. They don't do that much uh, knockback. They just keep it in one place to the fight power up really easily. Okay. Sheik is having a bit of trouble getting back to the stage. Yeah. Uh, even percentage wise, but. Yeah, no real team showing a huge advantage as far as those control players. Oh! Oh, nice team Forward combo. Throw. Forward throw into back the air. Into the back air. Very quick conversion. That's the type of conversion you need to see. Uh, oh, up smash out of shield, though. All right, Charlie going stock for stock. You got up smash. Yeah, going stock for stock there. Oh, there wow. it is. Got punched with throwing the... So we tried to like a free smash attack from Bayonetta. Gotta be careful with uh, throws you choose to use. Way too much lag, very easy punch, especially in this There we go, up to the string, covered the rip time. Good to grab. Oh, nice advantage from Dynamo. Stocks right back to even here, but uh, Bayonetta's getting tagged up pretty hard. Most unhealthy hero on the screen. Aside from Fox. Yeah, good stuff from Dynamo protecting Charlie's recovery. Oh, good down smash from oh. Set. Afro to the side. The other side of the stage. Super doing a great job of putting both numbers of the off the stage. Oh, but he let Charlie get to the stage. Sneak up on uh, Afro there and get the stock. And now, uh, Bane has seen on the last stock. Charlie's getting oh. in there. Oh, my goodness. Amazing uh, header spike there with the uh, side. Hot. Yeah. That volley yeah. final skip. Now we're seeing more forward throw combos with the green team. Yeah, uh, right now the best support on the screen is definitely Wee Turn. Staying really healthy and actually doing really good. Good job of just interrupting a lot of these combos. Being very disruptive in all these situations, which is why the team is so strong. Oh, the yeah, Dynamo almost oh. destroyed off stage. And Volleyball almost took Charlie's stock. Oh, the so tech from Charlie once again. The boy is in there, stage back, but four throw at the leg. Really strong kill throw. Afro's gonna get him right out of there. Stay on his last stock. Really uh, high percent here, but yeah, that was it. We need one team. stock apiece. We turn Chandler holding on to that stock line. Yeah, Afro is just share stock here, putting right back in this game. Dynamo needs to stop getting hit. Oh, oh sniped. sniped! Wow, that was a super deep snipe there from the side beat. Eliminating Dynamo's last stock. And now Charlie's gotta do another 2v1 here. This time he's got a much healthier green team he has to deal with. And a uh, Bayonetta. And a Bayonetta. Really gonna just see yeah, that two v one where Afro oh. is gonna run in, be the be the ball. This man just took like three back airs at once. So I was like, team, so that's crazy. Oh, wow. so the head strike again. Oh my goodness, look at this edge guard. How did Charlie get to his legs? I, I don't understand. I think uh, the volleyball actually hit Afro for the witch time activation. 
Oh. Yep. Hey, to back air. Take him out. One, one in the best. Two out of three. Green team staying alive here, saying that Team Synergy actually can defeat Cold Hard Cash. $165 investment. Round one winners. Well, Are you gonna go as of right now, losers? Cold Hard Cash is doing even with Team Synergy. Let's see if Cold Hard Cash can win. I don't know, man. Kind of hoping Cold Hard Cash. I, I, I mean, I, I definitely feel pretty bad if Dynamo paid $165 just to lose round one. But <laughs> that, I don't know, the adjustment there was definitely real. Dynamo getting tagged off stage, actually going really deep off stage to try to Ezra, a trainer, but not really familiar with how to deal with these hitboxes and just losing a lot of early stocks. So I kind of want to see Dynamo. Stay on stage, really. Don't really challenge Weechor to train off stage. That's really what uh, yeah. he wants. That's I why he stays so much at the ledge. Dynamo definitely needs to pull back. Let Charlie be the aggressor and you know, play the support role. Yeah, she gets such a good support. Go! Such a good team. Yeah. Oh, hopefully, hopefully Dynamo, hopefully Dynamo does the same. Oh, fireball disruption. Oh, which time? Oh, super active. He can actually convert there, but gotta watch out for that. Yeah, this Dreamland counter pick is really preferred stage for both Charlie and Dynamo. They're both really good at using platforms uh, to combos. But I'm curious to see how they're going to utilize it in teams because Green Team's playing a lot of stage right now. True. I would, I would expect that these platforms would give Green Team an advantage when it comes to doing the combos and avoiding Leech Works projectiles, but it's not looking like that. You can get scooped up by Witch Twist. I'm really liking the choice of Green Team right now. You're just, uh, use these kind of double team Fox. They can get so many uh, team counters on Fox being a fast caller. Which time you got it there. No matter how much uh, Sunny was in there, Dynamo wasn't fast enough to actually intercept Afro from getting that kill. So just the first time Charlie actually dropping the stock first on Blue Team. So Dynamo's actually going to have to hold the stock even longer than he was before. But only 50, 60 percent on the weak foot trainer. Oh yeah, He's definitely oh, doing a great job of being a classic. Tank. Yeah, classic weak foot trainer. Apple goes in, does all his damage. We took him to six and clutch. Kind of hits Charlie. Classic. I don't think these guys are ever seen before. To be honest. I mean, you would think so because they're like such so good friends. They talk all the time. I honestly don't think Charlie does teams like ever. Really. To be honest, I was really surprised when Charlie went for that price because we can only think of one time where he did a, a great job in double. Oh yeah, that was with uh, TLC. TLC. Yes. That was like months ago. That was, that was back when we were at Gardena. Yeah. So that'd be a long time ago. Alright. He's trying his best to stay in here. Charlie's already at his last stock. Dynamo has been relegated to the stock team. And like, that's cool. Yeah. That's, it's definitely rough now, the situation. He's worked still like at three stocks. Yeah, he's a classic retro. Like I said, man, this guy's a stock tank. He stayed at this ledge. He disrupted. He's getting his little chip down. Wow. Oh, my the team kill. Take the stock? Jesus yeah, sure. Yeah. He banished his own partner. I mean, he got the net too. <laughs> All right. Team $165 is out of here, man. Uh, Dynamo's already gone. I'm sure the, the dollar amounts out there, just for reference. Okay, so oh, we have the dollar amounts at the bottom of the screen. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh my god, he's out of here. The shadow $165. Into the shadows. Gone. Goodbye. To the exactly. GG. Maybe in the alternative winner's bracket. Yeah. So $40, $165, $40 coming out on top because these guys literally team all the freaking time. Uh, what an investment. Yeah, I mean, I'll take a $40 win over a $165 win. I'll take those odds.